Hey guys, it's uh, Kerry Cobb Speed Caps. Hey, I was out here doing a video and the video was starting to get a little too long. I wanted to go over my new line of products and some oils and some solutions to the problems I was having with leaking seals. I've been doing this for 20 years and I've constantly had to put seals in my trailers. Uh, over and over again, the seals would only last a short period of time, usually about six months to a year and I was putting new seals in them again. And uh, I just finally just got fed up. And what I did was I came up with a solution using a multi-purpose, uh, actually an EP, uh, extreme pressure grease, a uh, good quality grease. And I mixed it with a synthetic oil. And that actually solved my problems. Uh, I stopped having to put seals on my trailers all the time. Matter of fact, I've got uh, years and years out of my seals and I'm going to show you what that consistently that, that actual consistency look like. I still have some left, but I recently switched. I switched and I started using some Super S and I'm going to go over that with you guys here and I'm re really really happy with it. But that's what it looks like. I you know using that uh grease and mixing it with an oil, mixing it with a uh, gear oil. That's the consistency that I came up with. Uh I, I'm doing this cuz I'm going to show you how this uh the stuff will flow. Now this is the grease you guys pack them with grease. That solves the problem too. But the problem with that is you can't get that grease out of there. If you want to do maintenance on it, you got to tear down that hub uh, to get the grease out of there. You might as well go ahead and put a seal in. So you might as well keep it, uh, the, uh, the gear oil in there. Now, this is another solution. And, but when I ran the Lucas Hub Oil, great product, love Lucas products. You're going to hear me say that over and over again in other videos. The problem with that was my temperatures and my hub started coming up. And you're like, well, how do you know the temperature started coming up? If you look at my other videos, I carry a laser gun with me. You got to check your temperatures and uh, your transmission on your truck, your engine. Uh, so it's a good it's a good idea to know what your temperatures are uh, are uh, are at in your uh, in your hubs. So uh, I'm constantly checking, make sure because that's a telltale sign when you've got a problem, you got uh, an issue with a hub, a bearing, something going on in there. Could even be a break temperatures of that hub will let you know that there is an issue. But I started using this Super S and I'm putting it on there. The reason I'm doing this, I'm going to show you the consistency and the reason why I like this Super S and, uh, and that's what I'm running in my hubs now. But these were the four solutions. I know you guys already know about the Lucas Hub Oil. It's real, real popular. It's one of the, one of the only, really only solutions you have out there when you've got a leaking seal uh, and you need to do it immediately. But I'm gonna pick this up and show you that that, that um, there's the uh, solution I came up with. It runs pretty good. The Lucas runs pretty good. Both of those would stay in my hub and wouldn't get past that seal until that seal really just decided to let go. And um, it, uh, it would start getting past the seal maybe at about three or four years usually. But I've got seals in my trailer now that are probably right at about five, six years old. And I'm running this Super S. And as you can see, that Super S is making its way down this piece of paper. I'm trying to hold it still so I'm not shaking it. But uh, yeah, there's the grease. It ain't going anywhere. But well, this is grease also. But it's, a, but it's that double zero. It's more, it's more like a uh, oil and it flows more like an oil than it does a grease. And uh, it's been doing a tremendous job. I've been super pleased with it. Video is going to run, is running long here. I didn't want it to run more than four minutes. I'm right at about that four minute mark, guys. But those are the four solutions over the 20 year period that I've been doing this. Uh, and I'm, uh, I'm kind of sold on this uh, Super S and uh, that's what I'm running now. And I probably will continue to run it. Love that product. Glad I found it. And hopefully this video helped you guys out. And uh, again, Kerry Cobb Speed Caps. Thanks for watching.